Hey guys, this is uh, Sean Sean. Just want to give you a tip of the day. Uh, one place you can really go shop for art supplies that a lot of people probably don't think about is your hardware store, aka Home Depot, aka Osh. Uh, what you can do in here is um, you can buy those really big two, three, four inch brushes. And they have even smaller brushes. And again, this probably is more for um, probably more for your underpainting. If you do a lot of fine detail, you're probably going to use artist brushes on top of that. But for your first couple layers, don't use expensive brushes. Just use these cheap brushes. You can get really nice brushes. And you can also get other um, supplies that painters use that, you know, house painters that paint walls and buildings do. I use like cement trowels. Um, there's uh, paint guides you can use. You can use that to get a straight line. You can buy... Um, your blue tape there it's a lot cheaper than at the art store uh, masking tape is usually cheaper there um, I buy my angles there which I put into the frame to kind of sturdy those those are door hinges this make the stretcher bars um, stronger these are if you're making your own stretcher bars you can make your own stretcher bars again um, they have thin pine wood there um, <clears throat> you can you know get either like two inch pine don't buy other types don't buy redwood Pine is the best. They also have flat surfaces, so you can actually make your own complete frame. I used to make them for like 15 bucks each. The only problem is you run out of space quick because they're wood, so canvas. You can actually take canvas off your stretcher bars and roll it, so that's a lot more um, space efficient if you're producing a lot of work and it's not quite selling at the rate you want. But if you are selling the woodworks, you can definitely make them. They're definitely cheap. I would only do this if you got small volume, though. Um, so that's you know a couple of things you can get there you can get wood glue there so it's going to be a lot cheaper um and it's priced a lot cheaper because uh the you know wall painters go there for the cost they don't go there to say like ooh, it's gold paint da, da, da. you know they don't care about that so um i mean you could probably even use the paint there but <laughs> that might be going a little bit a little bit far on your underpainting using house paint but anyway that's my tip of the day thanks guys